Today's poultry industry offers one of the safest and most nutritional food products anywhere. Through more than 60 years of research and innovation, poultry producers have made giant strides in providing nutritious, healthy, and economical meat and eggs for consumers here in the U.S. and around the world. The success of the poultry industry has been so incredible that some people are naturally skeptical. How is it possible for today's birds to be grown and brought to market so much quicker than ever before? Unfortunately, this question has led to no small amount of speculation. Most popular among the myths is the suggestion that growers use hormones in poultry production. The misinformation about hormones has been so widespread that many consumers assume the worst. Instead of simply asking whether hormones are used in poultry products, the more common question is, why are hormones used? So let's back up and get straight to the truth. The simple answer is no. No hormones are used in the production of chickens and turkeys, period. To help better understand, let's hear from an expert, Dr. Susan Watkins, a University of Arkansas professor with the Center of Excellence for Poultry Science. Yes, U.S. poultry producers have definitely been the target of a number of unfounded rumors concerning hormone use, particularly in recent years with the rise in consumer interest in how our food is produced. The response should be there is no logical reason or incentive to even justify hormone use. The explanations are based in science, economics, and the law. First, from a biological standpoint, the poultry industry has no use for steroids. Over years of research, scientists have made tremendous advances in genetics and selective breeding, naturally selecting for the traits desired by today's consumers. Nutritious feed formulations provide adequate protein and energy for each stage of the bird's development. In addition, Today's poultry barns are built and are equipped to maximize bird comfort and safety, ensuring ideal growing conditions. Another fact of science is that feeding hormones to a chicken or turkey is simply not effective. Digestion merely converts hormones into basic amino acids, which destroys their function. So the only way for a growth hormone to work would be to inject it into the bird every day. And that's where we get into the economic fallacy of using hormones and raising poultry. The logistics and expense of injecting millions of chickens and turkeys on a daily basis simply would not be feasible. And finally, there is the legal aspect. For many years, the use of hormones in poultry feed has been strictly prohibited in the United States by the Federal Food and Drug Administration. Similar restrictions also exist in the European Union and most developed nations. Clearly, all these factors, science, economics, the law, and quite frankly, plain common sense, weigh heavily against any practical use of hormones in poultry production. In the face of these truths, the myths simply don't stand up. As a mother, I understand and share your desire to serve safe, nutritious meals to our families. As a poultry scientist, I can assure you today's poultry is wholesome and healthy and are never fed or treated with hormones. The poultry industry is proud of its history and role in providing a safe, healthy food product that is both rich in protein and affordable in cost. Looking ahead, poultry will continue to be on the forefront of advances in food production worldwide. So please, help us spread the truth about poultry and expose the fiction behind the hormone myth. Rest assured that the chicken, eggs, and turkey you enjoy today and in the future will always be of the highest quality, wholesome, and safe. Thank you for your interest and support of the poultry industry. This message was brought to you by the U.S. Poultry and Egg Association. Funding for this video was provided by the International Poultry Expo.